Hello and welcome back to TechIt. Welcome back to Minecraft. Uh, welcome back to me without any of my stuff. Um, if you've watched the last several episodes, you'll notice that things haven't been too kind for me uh, as far as um, trying to get some, you know, uh, get ahead in some of the mod packs, or even finding an emerald for the um, for that for that workstation for the uh, power suits. And, uh, you know, in the last episode, I foolishly decided to go into one of those dimensional doors. And, uh, well, of course, I fell into limbo. And I ended up digging my way out of the bottom of the world and losing all my stuff. So let's take a look. If you look, not, not out of there. I went to the quarry, got some of this stuff out of there. And speaking of quarry, it stopped again. So what we're going to have to do... Well, I don't even have a wrench now, do I? Um... Gosh, let's do a wrench. I think the wrench I need was was it even a wrench? Was it a thermal expansion? I think, or was it Minecraft Mine Factory? Let's try Mine Factory. Nope, I think it was thermal expansion. Yeah, because it had all this stuff. Now, where's that little wrench? Oh, right there. Crescent, crescent hammer. Tin and iron. Easy enough. Easy peasy. So, the goal is to get started uh, with applied energetics. Whoops, I'm not even looking at the right spot. Um, do I have iron? Yes, I do. One of those. And some tin. I think I need three. So, iron. Tin. And of course not. Alright, where'd it go? Tin and three iron. <laughs> of course. Two, three, and one tin. Let's try that again. Now I lost my wrench to limbo. Let's go ahead and go to the quarry. And see what we can see. It's obviously uh, my computer's been off, so it's not dug too far. The flood is huge. That's cool, I suppose. Is there anything in here? Nope. Oops, shift. There we go. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and swap this out. All right, the other one isn't all the way full. Again, that's the result of me not having the game running all the time. I'm really going to have to look into putting this on server. Um, but what I will do is take the first one, plop it here, make sure we're... Alright, that's what I like. And I'll just use the second one to the best of my ability. Whoops. Shift. There we go. And there it is. Now... We'll go ahead and put this back on the quarry just so it'll be running a little bit. And then we'll start looking at Applied Energistics. So, Applied Energistics is a way to build let's applied, um, computer components so you can convert your stuff into a little electricity, electrical pattern of some sort, store it in the computer you can store way more stuff than chests and once we get a little bit more advanced we can start pumping you know once we get a quarry that's actually working and other things like that uh, we can pl pump stuff into the computer but the first thing we're going to need is an ME controller which is right here now this has a bunch of um, odd looking stuff so we got iron, we got flux crystals, which is redstone, nether quartz, and ceratus quartz. Now I know we have nether quartz somewhere, right there. I might have to get some more. And we're going to need a bunch of this and a bunch of this. Because, if I remember correctly, uh, to make some of this stuff, like this, we need four of them. So if we do one, two, three, four... I may have to go into 
the nether gets more quartz. We need to armor up for that. So we shall see, right? So what else do we need? So I got four of these. I need one of these ME advanced processors. Now I thought I was going to have to do um, uh, get build one of those assembly tables and the lasers and all that. Um, what is it? Which I would if I was going to go with the redstone diamond chip set, because then I have to put it in the assembly table, shoot a laser at it, and uh, voila! After a while, and depending on how much power you put to it, you get your little piece. But what I can do is make one of these. It's a diamond to redstone and silicone, and silicone is simply uh, smelted quartz powder or quartz dust. So I'll just go ahead and put some quartz dust. Let's put four in there for now. And that will should go up in here as silicone. Yep, there it is. Now the other thing I need to make is a quartz stick. So we need so okay, which is not hard to do. Well I know where I can get plenty of wood. I just so happen to have a uh, a ton of the stuff that will be useful for uh, making whatever it's out of curiosity uh, so I'm going to take some of this wood and put it up in the other wood thing now I can get that going again once I get the computer up and running and I get enough storage oh the sun's going down um, but until then Go ahead and do that, and we'll take that. Make some sticks. Looks like that. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, actually, what I'll also do, since I have some coal on me, is make some torches because, well, I, when you die and lose all your torches, things aren't good. So let's go here, up here, and have a sleep. And there we go. Let's go ahead and grab our silicone up too. Um, so if I remember right, it was this, this, maybe a couple of these, and an iron. And I forgot to grab my iron. Let's go ahead and grab half of it. We'll do it again. Now these things lose durability over time. So what we're going to have to do is keep an eye on that. So I will need a diamond. Okay, let me grab a diamond. I don't have too many of them, but I hope I have enough to get myself started. Put you up here, put a couple of you over here. And uh, what else do I need? Oh, silicone. So we got one of these. I might have to make more if I'm going to do the. Uh, I will need the ME drive. These are. I'll need gold for these. Instead of a diamond, it'll be gold. I will need two of them for the ME drive. More iron. And what else will I need? I think it's. A, some sort of display thing and that's not it um, access terminal that's what I'll need which will have some weird stuff here so we'll see if we can't get that stuff made I'll just go ahead and make the rest of that I'll be right back okay I'm about to make it boom there it is now I'm gonna have to figure out where I want to put this thing I'll need access to power obviously or maybe not obviously Honestly, I don't know if I'll need access to power. Um, and these are a hardened energy conduit. Uh, I suppose I'll put it right here, and then I can just start transferring stuff. Now, what that means? See, there's no no power. And let's see if I have any energy. Let's energy. Do we have hardened? There we go. We do have hardened. So what I'm going to do 
is the quick and dirty uh, make an axe. I'm going to make an axe. How's since I don't have jack shit. Let's put these arrows in here. Bones, maybe not. Let's see if there's bones. Uh, let's see what else do we need. Oh, an axe. Easy to get distracted in Minecraft. Whoops. Let's go ahead and do this. And we will go ahead and do this. So I have an axe. Now all I need to do is dig to some power. Nice. So what I can do... Oh, wait a minute. Okay, what was I? I just got myself all turned around. All right. All right, I'll be back. Okay, we got some power set up. If we right click on that, we have energy. Looks like it's doing pretty good. And I'm not sure what all the uh, other stuff does yet, but I'll figure it out, right? So all I need to do is build the other parts. Uh, but before I do that, let me fill in the floor because you know uh, health and safety. Oops. Let's go ahead and put you there and there. So there we go. We have the the power all set up. Now it looks like its power is low. It's not getting enough power. Maybe. Do I need? That's going to suck if I have to upgrade my um, power capabilities. Oh, and the quarry is stuck. Well, let's go look at the quarry. Well, it didn't take long for it to suck through all that power. Let's see what else we got here. Well, we got some tin, copper, and stuff. More stuff we'll actually need. So what I will do is go ahead and take that. Whoops. Take that and head back underground. All right, we have a problem here. It's actually kind of be kind of a big problem. And it's one I'm going to have to tackle sooner rather than later. As soon as I get done with my applied energistics stuff I want to do today, I think it's going to be what I'm going to have to tackle next and I'm going to have to find a way to generate way more power because I am power starved. You know, the quarry is barely getting along. I mean, we've got a few things, whoops. But I need to be more efficient with the power. I'm wondering if I need to start building or try to start going down the atomic power or uh, the reactors just because this is getting frustrating, not having enough power. Without enough power, it's hard to get resources without spending hours digging underground, which I'm trying to avoid. But, I mean, I got some resources here. Um, you know, I'd like to get my power suit up and running. Energy use 60 AE. But anyway, we won't worry about that. Let's get on with the applied energistics. All right, we're about to make the ME drive which we'll go ahead and I need a chest Whoops. and I have a chest which is sweet All right, let's try that again ME drive so I have these two things I have some glass some iron and I have the all-important chest and it's doing absolutely nothing glass iron oh because I am such an idiot. Then turn that off. We'll go ahead. I need to cook these two things. Ah, oh, forgot about that. Anyway, up oh, there, there they are. Let's go. All right, let's get this thing. Let's get this thing made. 
two glass or iron and a couple of these ME basic processors boom there it is now I'm going to go ahead and I don't have any drives made this is getting pretty full of power as as I was saying before I'm getting power starved if I if I need to power my computer to store my stuff and uh, I need to power a quarry and I need to power a ton of machines. I turn this back on. Alright. Paris. Okay. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to have to do something about the power. So I, it might be another between game or between sessions where I'm going to have to go down and uh, dig and get resources. I might need to set up a mob spawner too because. Um, like I need ender pearls and all that kind of fun stuff. So anyway, but I think I'm gonna start with a small reactor to set up a small one that might, might, you know, power our stuff for what we need. But when the base expands, we're going to have to uh, upgrade our power. Okay. Oh, also speaking of power, you can see my little bar here is uh hate and life so yeah i am very power starved at the point at this moment um so i think that will be my next session is to see if i can't build a a small reactor of some sort we shall see okay i just got done making my me access terminal and this might be just a little more uh, Let's put it right. Oops. Let's put it right here. Now I need a drive. Oops. I don't have a crafting table part set up, which is fine. I'll, I'll worry about that later. But I do need a drive, so I think I am going to make a 4K drive. Okay, that's 16K. That's 64. That's 1K. Coded pattern. I mean, four K storage. So, what's the one K? Needs one of these, which is just. All right. What's the four K? Needs one of these, which is three of these. Nope. I'm just gonna do one K drive. Um. I'll need another one of those. So I need more gold. Whoops. So we will use more gold. Again, I'm doing this because um, I do not have the resources. I'm going to probably have to go digging again. And silicone. I need silicone. I wish you could use the other silicone. Okay, cool. Let's do that. Uh, there it is. Some silicone. Life is good. All right, let's try that again. This, this, piece of gold, a piece of silicone, and our little tool gives me one of those. And we'll go ahead and, whoops, I don't want to do that. What I want to do is put you right here. And we'll grab it out of here. Now, let's make our 1K drive. Oh, yeah, I need to make this first. So, not hard. I got plenty of quartz stuff here. And our little processor, and boom. Now, we can do a 1K storage. Let's go ahead and do this. This glass and the redstone okay our first our first hard drive and we'll put you right there and now I, I don't think I have enough um, oops. Uh, power do I oh it's offline 
so it has both of these and I can't put anything in there yet because I don't have enough power. I have to learn not to do that. There we go. So now I can click in there. Power is low. So we need to do something about low power. Uh, one thing I'm going to do is convert Uh, all these pipes and this little bad boy down here into hardened leadstone energy cell. So I will be back when I, when I get that done. Okay, so I've changed this to hardened energy conduit. I've changed this to a hardened energy cell. It is currently not charging up with jack crap. Uh, these are all full. And I'm assuming, I'm hoping, that these are actually charging 18. So what I'm going to do is go back downstairs and uh, I'm going to pull off these other energy sucking things. Let's go ahead and pull this off and this off. And let's see if now... Is it going up? No, it's not going up. Uh, let's see what else we have. Actually, let's do this. Let's get rid of that. Now let's take a look at. Oops. Let's get rid of that. Now let's take a look at uh, this. It's not going up. Well, that begs the question then. Uh, do I have this thing set up properly? First, let's see if it's online. Okay, sweet. So I can put stuff in there. Oops. Here we go. All right, this is sweet. And our drive has 18 of 1,024. Okay, so let's go ahead and put a bunch of wood in there. Now I think it takes energy every time we put wood in there. Let's go ahead and put wood. Okay, we have a ton of wood in there. And we really don't need this anymore. So I can use my shitty. Or maybe, there we go. And actually, I can. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Now, until I get the power situation taken care of, I don't want to put too much in there. We'll put a chest in there. Um, oh! Would you look at that? Uh, old armor. That just made me really happy. <laughs> that just made me super happy. Um, item duct and fluid duct. We got a bunch of stuff in here. I'm not going to. Maybe I'll do like this. Yeah, I'll get all this stuff out. And I think if you... There we go. Make sure that was everything I wanted to put in there. Except these and these. Maybe not this. So anyway, this is one of my favorite things about or the mod pack. This is what I was looking forward to uh, working towards. Uh, the computer. Now I have it up and running, more or less. Uh, now I get, need, just need to get some sort of stable uh, power. So if we go boom, 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 boom. 
See what we're doing. 487 of 1024. Uh, we're going to have to make another drive, but I think when I do that, I'm going to make a 4K drive. So 1K, 4K, and then we'll get up to 16 and 64K and whatever. And we'll be able to store lots of stuff. Anyway, I uh, got a lot done. Got a lot done today. Makes me happy. Uh, oops, let's go ahead and put this up there too. And we'll put the torches. At least some of them. Lapis lazuli. I'll put that in there. I think we're going to be okay with the power a little bit. I'm not going to put everything in there. I can get rid of this. And I'll even put that chest up in there. So, we've gotten a lot of stuff in here. We got a lot done. I'll need that too. Um, I'll go ahead and put my. Uh, batteries back down here on the charging area wherever they are one here just like that and they're both charging again I hope yeah and this thing is not charging <laughs> I don't know if it's just a net sum or net zero, net zero, it's an ancient internet provider, uh, net sum game or if something else is going on. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and take off and we'll see you next session.